Alrighty, Lewis, how's everyone doing? We're back once again. I tried to get in a normal game, but it took 14 minutes to the queue, and um, there was still no end in sight, so I'm just going to go straight into a, another intro bot game once again. So my apologies for that, but sometimes it's all you can do. You only do so much. <laughs> um, but that's fine, because this will be a quick game, and if after, um, if it is like a 10-minute game or so, I will try to do a, an ARAM as well. As long as the um, the queue timer isn't too long. <laughs> that could screw us up a little bit though. We'll see. Anyways, until then, let me go into the items and see what we want to build exactly. I was kind of thinking going uh, type of lethality build, to be honest. And kind of interested in what you guys think. Um, this is just a rune page from before items, or item page before uh, items were changed, so all of this is kind of like a bit old and outdated. I've got to update all this, but it's kind of just nice a, a nice cheat sheet of most of the items that I tend to buy, um, generally speaking. Um, obviously, Infinity Edge would be great, and obviously Kraken Slayer would be great in a normal game, um, but like I said, I want to try something a little bit different today. I kind of feel like we should go Bloodthirster first, just to get the healing. And then after that, um, we could stay out on the map as long as possible, but um, we could absolutely just go uh, some lethality from there. Or we could go like Holebreaker or something as well if we wanted to. I think that would be perfectly fine. Ezreal here. I hope it's a bot and not a player because I'm gonna feel kind of bad trying to take all the CS. <laughs> we'll see though. We'll see. Feel like it's a bot, but I don't really know. Especially with that name. <laughs> Try to take as little damage as possible since we don't have a uh, Doran's blade, and Jinx doesn't have um, innate healing or um, whatever you call it. Sustain—that's the word I'm looking for. How long till demolish? Eight seconds. All right. That'll be fine, but it's probably gonna be after I get this plate, which will probably reduce the damage of the demolish. But it's okay. Not the end of the world. Alright, the Ezreal was able to last hit the uh, the Alistar, so he got first blood, sadly, but it's okay. Just means we wasted a little bit of our time. Or he wasted a little bit of our time. It's all good, though. No worries. Alright, there we go. Keep on keeping on. Nice, I was dig I didn't think I was gonna get that second minion there. But it looks like I somehow did, so that's great. Love to see that. Aw oh, man, his freaking comet. 
and Yi and Otto did quite a bit more damage than I was expecting. That's fine, though. Uh, we have to sit in base for this item, I think, though, because we didn't quite get enough. Kind of awkward to die there, but oh well. Good job, Israel. <laughs> Alright, we're almost there. About 15 more gold. I'm going to go ahead and teleport now, so I can kind of do that cleanly. And then from there, we can just go lethality items. Honestly. <clears throat> because uh, lethality actually does work on turrets pretty well. Which really amps your damage pretty decently, so. That's what we'll be doing. Oh my gosh, my minions really messed me up there. I missed like all three of those CS. Yes. Oh well, it's fine. Yeah, back in the day, actually, people used to thresh uh, Bloodthirster as ADCs, get that extra sustain and such. But definitely different nowadays with all the different items you can do. Another thing people used to rush was Infinity Edge on almost every ADC. But, they don't really do that much anymore. <laughs> what? Am I getting tank? Oops, I didn't need ult. I didn't think I'd crit there. That's fine though. Not a big deal or anything continue to try to get this turret down so we can continue on. Oh man, he walked out of my range so the Ezreal got the kill. That's unfortunate, but it is what it is. <clears throat> Alright, we have enough for our first lethality item. But uh, I want to strategically back here, try to get as much damage on this turret as I can. Of course the minion blocked it. <laughs> Typical. I think we should go ahead and recall here real fast. It's not a, not the worst recall timing, honestly. Hmm, that seems nice. This is uh, my armor and magic pin, but it's not exactly what I'm looking for. I don't think. More like lethality type stuff. Let's go ahead and get some boots as well. That should speed us up a little bit, and then of course it'll give us attack speed as well. But yeah, pretty much just uh, lethality items. Does this uh, not build into like Eclipse anymore? Oh, it doesn't. What the heck? That's so weird. Or uh, it doesn't build into Dra Dusk Blade of Drakthar anymore, I guess. It's kind of interesting. Oh wait, I thought I think Dust Blade is still in the game, right? Had my rocket out, sadly. It's fine though. There we go. <clears throat> yeah, what does Dust Blade get built out of? Wait, I Dust Blade is still in the game. Oh no, wait, no, it isn't. That's right. That's right. Well, never mind. <laughs> 
Yeah, it'll actually help us kill them quicker as well. Super fast. <laughs> nice. About 11 minutes. Not too bad. Not too bad. Not too shabby. GG. Yeah. Let's try to get into a an ARM game. But I think if the game if the queue takes longer than like four or five minutes, I'm just gonna skip it. We'll see though. We'll see. Alright, and looks like we got another level up. Let's go. Nice. Basic champion capsule. And that looks like level 18. So there we go. We're uh, a little bit over halfway to level 30 already. So that's really nice. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and try to get into an ARAM real quick. Got a few icons from previous, um, the previous time. Blitzcrank and Lee Sin. Nice. I actually do like Blitzcrank quite a bit. And uh, when you get these shards, it actually does discount the uh, champions a little bit, so it's pretty nice. A little bit from what the uh, the actual cost was. Nico's actually um, a champ I do quite like a lot, so that's someone we can <clears throat> kind of look forward to getting. She's a little bit expensive, but that's perfectly fine. All right, come on. Let's let's get a match quick. <clears throat> what we got on sale today? Oh, Battle Bat Vein, Dragon Slayer Pantheon. It's a good skin. Star Guardian Sin is pretty. Excuse me. Uh, pretty decent skin. Something just fell. <laughs> um. Wood Scout Quinn isn't too bad actually. It's a decent price. Meow yeah, Kai's okay, a great skin. <laughs> That's a pretty good price as well, to be honest. Battle Wolf Silas. Silas. Interesting. I feel like that would be a cool skin, but I don't know. But yeah, anyways, um, we could disenchant these if we want to. I think I'm just going to hold on to them for now, though, just in case. All right, I think if we it hits like 2 minutes 30 seconds, I'm just going to gonna call the video there. Nice, we got an honor from the previous game. Uh, but yeah, we got a uh, patch. This is patch 14.2, by the way. I haven't really looked very deeply into the patch notes, but um, some cool changes, some interesting changes for sure. But yeah, um, you can definitely check out our um, our uh, patch note video if you haven't seen it. Also, this this champion I have not actual um, I've not actually looked at his abilities like super close. I've seen like a quick overview, and they look pretty cool. But um, yeah, we'll have to definitely check him out when he releases on the thirty first. As of this recording, uh, it still hasn't, it's not the 31st quite yet, but yeah, sometimes I just have to pre-record the, the episodes because it is, I mean, I just don't have enough time, honestly, to be able to record like every day. I wish I did though. May, hopefully in the future. Yeah, absolutely. All right. Well, it's, uh, it's been about three minutes of queue. I think I'm going to go ahead and call it here. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I really do appreciate it and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.